2023 has arguably been an exceptionally busy year for Uganda police force and other security agencies given the terrorism activities have happened severally in some parts of the country. Most attacks were linked to the Allied Democratic Forces rebels. This year started on a sad note when some 10 people died in a stampede at Freedom City Mall in Kampala. These were part of the revelers who were at the shopping mall to celebrate the new year. Police was on the spotlight and was blamed for failing to protect the revelers. Terrorists believed to be ADF rebels launched their activities in several parts of the country, targeting police stations and schools. Police have shouldered the blame for not protecting civilians in some cases, like the June attack on Lubiria Secondary School in Kasese district, where at least 40 people died. All this and more shortcomings have had devastating impact on individuals, families and the country at large. Despite these challenges, uh, the IGP is pleased uh, to announce that uh, 2023 has also been a good year for policing in the country, uh, where the police and sister security agencies of the UPDF prisons, SFC, the joint intelligence components of CMI, ISO, CI and ESO, the joint anti-terrorism task teams carried out specific and joint special operations which made our country Uganda one of the safest countries on the continent. So what would police consider as achievements recorded this year? To a great extent, we reduced gun-related crimes and proliferation of illegal firearms and ammunition. Uh, we reduced on terrorism, gang and marine uh, crimes house breakings, uh, burglaries, acid attacks, motor vehicle thefts, even the cut raids within Karamoja and the neighboring districts uh, were reduced and even many other traditional crimes. 2024 is just about one week away and police is optimistic that it will be a better year in terms of policing and law enforcement. We anticipate huge policing ambitions in the year 2024. We plan to strengthen our business and case management systems under the EPIS, that is the Electronic uh, Policing Information System Project, an integrated digital platform for management of policing services, establish an online complaints, complaints management system at the Professional Standards Unit. Daniel Kibet, NTV, Weekend Edition.